What is going on here? Growing concerns over the Zika virus have caused the New Zealand Olympic Committee to advise all athletes who are pregnant or hoping to get pregnant in the, next in the near future not to travel to the Rio Games in August. Barbara Kendall is a five-time Olympian, winner of a gold, a silver, a bronze, and the first New Zealand female to compete at that many Olympic Games. She's a three-time world board sailing champion and also mother of two daughters. She became a mum while still an Olympian. In fact, a world title and two more Olympics were to follow her becoming a mother. She joins us now by Skype video call from Hot Water Beach. Barbara, it's lovely to talk to you as always. This is a nightmare decision for athletes, isn't it? Absolutely. Well, it's it also, I think it's, um, you know, it makes a big question for those that are wanting to retire after the Olympics or have children after the Olympics, you know, w whether they want to take that risk or not. I would doubt very many of the athletes will be pregnant at the Olympic Games because it's not a very safe thing to do. You yes. know, it's not a, not a good decision to do if you want to get a peak performance, be, you know, become a, pregnant at the Olympic Games. But afterwards, and I, I don't think we have enough research yet to tell us how long that that virus stays in your body to when the safe period begins or ends. But, you know, if I was an athlete and, you know, because both after Sydney and Athens, I was pregnant virtually three weeks after the Olympic Games, I'd be questioning my decision and probably delaying for a little bit till I got the all clear, that's for sure. I, I think, yes, this is confusing now because we were hearing two years. Dr. Don Mackey just said three weeks. So this is really confusing. There seems to be a lack of clarity around information. But when you think how hard you have to train and how much you have to sacrifice to be an Olympian, the idea that actually you've got to either give up on becoming a parent for a period of time or give up on your Olympic dream, it's just a terrible uh, yeah, decision. It is a big decision because it's such a life change. Either one is such a life changing experience, um, you know, decision. But, you know, if I put my hat on of an athlete, if I'd been training for, you know, we know it's a minimum of about eight years, it's 10,000 hours, you would go, right, I could sacrifice maybe another whatever it takes to know that I'm care of the virus before I got pregnant. So it is a, it's a big decision. But I think if you're a smart person, you go, okay, I'm going to. I go to the Olympic Games, I've worked my life for this, I'm going to do it, tick that box, and then I'll look at, um, you know, starting a family once I'm all clear. Yeah, Barbara Kendall, thank you, Barbara. Really nice to talk to you as always. Barbara Kendall, who was joining us by 